everyone and welcome back to uh, Blueport Pleasure Beach. Uh, what is Blueport Pleasure Beach? I don't know either, it's been so long. <laughs> but uh, once again, uh, I'm joined again by the great Wix. Hello. Yeah, yeah, Hello. Yeah. Welcome. Yeah. <laughs> great to be back. Uh, <laughs> no, no, let's just start with a little introduction of Blueport again. Uh, it's entirely uh, up to, uh, like my fault that it's been so long but uh, it's a park wix and uh, i have been working on for like two years to th think at this point two years has uh, it really been two years i think so uh, like yeah Damn. nearly i think uh, this october it will be two years but we we we, we we can we now we can pick uh, we, now i can pick up the pace again because you were like uh, enthusiastic about it but I just need... To, I'm back in the groove a bit. Uh, uh, yeah, anyway, I'm building yes. a go-kart track. I'm building a go-kart track. Uh, I thought, oh, that's awesome. a nice addition. Like a little waterside go-kart track. So you saw me building it already here. And I built this in like in April. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, I lost the save file. Couldn't find... No, that's all bullshit. But um, uh, yeah, just using a lot of concrete and uh, like smooth shapes here. And I'm pretty happy with the layout. Uh, and then uh, put asphalt in the middle and then the fencing you will see a pretty like a lot of fencing being done in this video um, but yeah a go-kart track because I thought that would be a great fit uh, for like like a park like this you know it's not like a major yeah. themed ride it's I, uh, just a bit of thrill mm -hmm. I dig it I think it's a it's a cool way of uh, like it's low budget and stuff right and you know it's a, it works well. Yeah, it's like an well. upselling thing, right? You go here and you mm -hmm. pay like an extra 20 euros or pounds or dollars to, to uh, do the go-kart thing. And it's a nice, another uh, source of income for this park. And uh, I tried to go uh, a bit more than just a trick and I added like a like stand or tribune. How do you say that in English? I don't know. Where people can it's, sit. Yeah. It's actually built on top of Pitt Street. Uh, there's no cars in there, but um, the, the the general like vibe of this is pretty like basic. But I still like feel maybe I need to add something in terms of detailing. But I couldn't think of one, so I'm just gonna leave it uh, as it is now. It's fine. But I thought, oh, maybe we can add something later on uh, after we're done with the park to like make it a bit more attractive. But uh, it works like this as well. So we'll just have to see about that. Um, Anyway, okay. just building the stands here. Uh, a lot of woods. I built this on stream actually. That's also a long time ago. But <laughs> I actually, I actually remember seeing you building this. Yeah, I was in your stream. Yeah, did, yeah, I yeah, think. yeah. Um, yeah, just uh, using hydro. I like the layout of the of the track of the go kart track though. That's pretty. How it bends, isn't it? how it bends over like the water side and kind of like have this super nice curve. It's it's juicy. I like it. It's thick. Mm. I, I like the oh, curves. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, uh, like I was uh, having so much, so many issues with how to theme this because I'm a big Formula One fan, right? And right. I thought, oh, I could just do that, but like, there's nothing really that stands out about a track, a racing track. Yeah, you have the yellow and white curbs or like the those racing barriers and uh, some fences, safety fences. And the pit street, but it's not really much else there. Like, yeah, you have the the paddock and wherever you like um, racing, uh, um, like house is. But that was all excessive for like a park thing. So I think, like it is now, it's fine. Um, but we can add flags or whatever later on if we want to. Um, I'm using um, Team TK roof here. I'm not sure what it it's called again. PBR roof. If I'm looking closely. <laughs> uh, That's yeah. cool. Uh I'll probably be able to download that because I don't think I have that piece. Oh, you're gonna have so. to download it to open the park. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I'm looking forward to getting back in here, man. I, I, like, <laughs> it's only because I had a comment on YouTube the other day that was like, "Bring this park back." <laughs> was it the same guy that's always always commenting that, like, uh, what's it, Luna? Uh, okay. No. No, I, I can't remember. I oh, can't yeah. remember, but yeah. uh, it's like, well, yeah, guy. I mean, it's. <laughs> I mean, it's it's a low budget park, right? So it goes slow in these parks, you know, guys. It's they don't just have the money to just throw around and yeah. things get done by so quick, you know. It's no money for big investments. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like maybe you the know, next I'm... episodes in three years or so, a Corona crisis, you know, uh, like. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it could could be. Could be. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's getting a bit. I, uh... Sorry. 
I really, really like it. Uh, I really like this edition here. Yeah. I love the track, as I said, and like how it, it fits with the, what is we calling this, Adrenaline so Oh yeah, Adrenaline so yeah, <laughs> something like stupid like that. <laughs> I had to, uh, you remember, like when I built that Enterprise ride, I uh, got rid of the, uh, no, I placed like a car and got yes. a burnout. I had to get rid of it because it was clipping with the ride and I only noticed it now. But uh, oh. I'll figure something out. It's it's all fine, and you can see the racetrack better now. Anyway, uh, but yeah, as I said, a lot of a lot of placing barriers. This was fun to do. Just listening to a podcast about theme parks. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that kid that got you through this. Damn. Yeah, yeah. It was about um, h how to do like a university university grade um, research in terms of uh, guest happiness. How that's done in real life instead of like. Blanco, huh. where you have to uh, make the umbrellas uh, more expensive in the, when it's raining to earn more money, stuff like that. No, but it was like really interesting. It was like a three-hour podcast, <laughs> uh, but I was, I was building this, and that's also why it took a bit longer than <laughs> than usual because I was just, oh, how can I like elevate this a bit? It's, it's like because it, when you start adding foliage, it starts looking nice and these tires. But it's still yeah. like yeah, it's just a racing track. But I, I think it it's a nice fit for the park, and especially when we start making like a coaster again uh, soon, it will be a bit more interesting. Of course, I had to do uh, some fencing uh, because I didn't like the blue fence and I didn't feel like changing the path, and it works better together. Um, <laughs> we're already over halfway of the video. It's a pretty short video, but uh, we just need to get into groove again of this park. Yes, we do. Yeah. This was kind of like, as, as Jordan said, this was it's for something you have have bad luck, bad luck since April or something, right? And, you know, like, so. Yeah. yeah. It's the, it's getting there again. I'll probably, I'll probably start on, on that other area uh, next time. Maybe oh, yeah. at a coaster. Wow. Yeah. All right. So here I'm starting placing foliage because that's uh, like a cheat code to make uh, everything look a bit better. Now, especially yep. in Planet Zoo. Planet Ghost is still good, but uh, that's what I like. That's the main difference for me between this and Planet Zoo is just the, the detail and the foliage and uh, just how good it looks. But we manage in this game. Uh, it, it looks fine, especially with reshade. If you try a bit, uh, the foliage can look pretty good. Uh, I still think this game is pretty. Yes, yeah, especially if you... Uh, well, I would say you know what you're doing, but it just well, yeah, yeah, it comes down to that. Like if you know how to take the right screenshots and uh, stuff like that, and the right uh, reshape presets, uh, this game actually still looks good. Um, but yeah, you can see how I built the foliage very basic, just a couple different type of uh, bushes and trees, some rock work, and uh, that's Ouch. about nearly it. Some rocks. Yeah, now just you're making a. Uh huh. Uh, stairway getting up there well yeah. they need to get up there i mean they can climb but there won't be a lot of people seated there i think <laughs> otherwise i'm also not sure how they get to that stairway <laughs> i haven't thought of that i realize now but, um, um we can always go in and change that at something you know yeah oh the, the work and title progress of this go-kart track is blended raceway so take that <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, well, I haven't seen all these things here. You added now all these new things. Oh yeah, this is a radio tower. You told me to build a radio tower. So I uh, just build ah, a radio right. tower, something uh, quick and easy. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, uh, that was actually the video. So thanks for watching, everyone. And uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> check out the previous and the next episode on Wix's channel. And I'll see you guys next yes. time. Bye. See ya. Bye.